We're hearing from the mother of Morgan Bowers. She was 19 years old when she disappeared seven years ago. Yeah, just yesterday, several police agencies and the FBI searched a property in Newton County in connection to her case. 11 Alive's Erica Murphy talked to Morgan's mom today about these new developments. Police last night finishing up a search of a house and a property not very far from the Porterdale Police Station, all in an effort to solve the disappearance of Morgan Bauer. Investigators are telling us that they did find evidence, but so far police are not sharing exactly what that evidence was. Today, I spoke with Morgan's mom about what the renewed interest in her daughter's disappearance means to her. So far, police aren't sharing why a search at 2 Broad Street was carried out in connection with Morgan Bauer's case but her mom, Sherry Keenan, says she's made peace with the unthinkable. I believe Morgan, if she were here, she would have reached out, you know, even if she didn't want to talk to me, you know, she would have reached out to her grandma. And for seven years, no one has heard from Morgan. Her mom says the last time she saw her baby girl, she gave her something to keep her safe. We didn't really talk. I gave her a penny, though. And I told her to put the penny in her pocket and just to keep it with her, to keep her safe. And... She was with a friend. I don't know who she was with. She walked off, and that was the last time I ever saw her. Morgan had just moved from South Dakota to Metro Atlanta two weeks before she vanished, leaving nothing but unanswered questions in her absence. But Keenan says Thursday's search will bring some closure and healing. To the family that lives at that house, to the parents of the people that live in that house, that I'm so sorry. <laughs> and they must love their child as much as I love mine. Several agencies, including the FBI, GBI, Peoria, Illinois Police, and the Newton County Coroner's Office were all called in. Porterdale Police Chief Jason Cripps is being cautious about sharing details, but says this case is important and he needed resources and people to make headway. Keenan says the FBI has been involved from the start. We've had someone that has been helping us with the FBI since day one, and I know she's on the ground there. Ruth Ann Sibbett lives in Covington. She says hearing about the search and Morgan's disappearance makes her uneasy. And it concerns me with my children and my grandchildren. So I always, you know, keep an eye out when they come up here. But it is a shame. Reporting from Porterdale, Erica Murphy, 11 Alive News.